Madison's Madison with two D's. M A D D I S O N. I'm so excited for this video, and I don't know why. I just, I really am. Um, hi everybody. My name is Madison. If you don't, are you crooked? It, I think it's gonna look the same. If you don't know me, now you do. Don't look at my feet. I'm Madison, and today I am gonna be trying to change my appearance as much as possible. Let's think of this more as alternate reality Madison. Madison from a different dimension. Like, I'm gonna be trying to change my appearance as much as possible, but I really just think I'll end up looking like me, but like, like a different vibe. I have an aesthetic, and that is gonna be fair tan baddie supermodel goes to overpriced cafes snatched face Mean girl. I'm really gonna be focusing on intense contouring and highlighting. Here's my face before. I don't have foundation that I like. I wish I had a foundation I like that also matched my skin tone, but I don't. So we're going with these, gonna mix them. This looks so bad. Okay, okay, I'm gonna wipe this off and come back. <laughs> I'm just, I need, I'm gonna listen to music and do this, okay? I dream of how we used to be in the day, the less convenient day, and how far from. Okay, now that I've quite literally done the 100 layers of foundation challenge. He's in the bed now. Little thing that came in the kit have, so contour brown is the color I'll be using. I'm painfully aware that my foundation does not match my skin tone. Swoop it up a little bit so it kind of lifts. No forehead for me. I have like not a super like sharp jawline, like it's not pronounced and I have a double chin always pops out and I hate it. <laughs> Did some of this witchcraft right here. I don't hate my nose. I don't want anyone to think I'm saying I hate my nose, but I feel like my nose is just like the most like, here's a nose. It's just an average nose. Not saying that's bad. In this alternate reality, maybe I got a nose job. I'm trying to blend, you know, blend it into right here because then it kind of helps lift it and you don't bring it down into this area. That is, that, what is that? How do people do this and look fine? Like look normal. That just look, maybe from straight on it's helping, but if I do this, <laughs> I feel like I just look insane, but we'll go with it, I guess. What brush should I use for this? Like, it's gonna make a difference and make it look good. And I'm gonna really kinda get it in the inner corner and on the side of the nose. I'm gonna try it, these guys, so it helps snatch the nose even more. Let's start studying this disaster. It just ain't my cup of tea. Susie B, please come back home. I was watching a video of someone who was like showing how they do their makeup and change their face shape. Anyway, they were talking about how if warmer tones are like meant for like all over bronzing and like bronzeness, but if you use a cooler tone, it's gonna really give you that like look like a shadow. Is this how much bronzer like people wear? Because I feel like it looks like I have a lot of bronzer on, because I do. Let's do a little blush. I just have this elf one that is... In this alternate universe, Madison does not wear as much blush as she does on our Earth. A little bit of blush that kind of connects the contour. She's not a blush crazy girl. She's like a supermodel. She doesn't need it. I'm gonna do my eyebrows really quick. I'm gonna try to have an arch in them because I feel like I haven't had arched eyebrows in a while. And we have eyebrows, everybody! Let's do my eyes. I think I'm gonna do kind of like a pinky look. If I'm doing like crazy makeup, you know what I'm saying? Like I don't do like insane like neutral looks. I do like crazy colored fun looks. Won't you come back 
I did a little bit on the inner corner, which I don't normally do because my eye shape just does not allow that to look good. I'm not gonna do a lot of mascara because I hate taking mascara off. I'm gonna try to like change my lip shape by kind of bringing in the inner corners a little bit and overlining just a tad bit. So now let's do the hair. I'm so excited. I think this is the main reason I wanted to do this video is so I could like do this hair. I have these bad boys. I made a video with these a while ago. I just got two like $10 extension ponytails from Amazon just to like have fun with for like photos and stuff. So as you can see they like wrap around the ponytail but if you're strategic enough you could just put them on your head. Now can you wear that out of the house? Probably not because you're gonna look insane. You'll see when I do it. But for a video, I can definitely get away with this. Take this top portion of hair. I'm gonna take some hair. I'm gonna do a tiny hair tie around it. If you've never seen a ponytail hair extension, it looks like this. And I take this piece and I just kind of tuck it under where the clip is. And then you take the clip portion and I'm just gonna slide that in where the ponytail is. Start bobby pinning this boy. And yeah, I just kind of tuck it behind. Before I show you, just remember y'all, I'm using stuff that I already had in my room, like, it's not perfect. I used to have hair this long at the end of sophomore year. I cut it off and I've had short hair since. Most people have told me that like I look better with short hair, like it just fits my vibe. But then I do this and like this, looking at myself, I'm not even like, wow, I look so good with long hair. It's just kind of fun. So let me know, do I look better with short or long hair? It's pretty good. Okay, $10 Amazon ponytail hair extensions. And I look like this. This dress is my mom's. I love it, it's something I would wear, but I felt like because we're in a pandemic, that's like the only thing I really do is like go to Costco, hang out with friends sometimes. And both of those things, it's like I'm often gonna choose like jeans. So that's why I went with this, just cause it's like I haven't worn it yet. Hey guys, so I've been just taking pictures, making TikToks for like maybe an hour, I don't really know. But I think I'm gonna go. Um, yeah. Let me know, do you like me better with long hair or with short hair? I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, do something about it. If you didn't, I'm so sorry. And maybe I'll see you next time.